to YouTube. It's Coyote Lovely. Um, that's right, we are here. This is one of the few times I have not rewatched the old videos to figure out where I am. Um, I know I say this every time, but man, has it been crazy in my life lately. Um, <laughs> so eternally I apologize for not being around as much as I thought I was going to. Hi, sheep. Um, but, um, but I'm back. I'm back. I'm going to record a couple tonight, so um, here again, if uh, if you're leaving a comment on this video and you notice that I don't say anything about it for the next couple of days, um, it is not that I didn't like your comment, it is that I have been just recording in the meantime and I haven't seen it yet. I'm in the past right now. Ha ha ha. Anyway, um, let's see. Let's see. Uh, we did get some comments um, and uh, and some very helpful suggestions, and uh, I think we're going to follow through with some of those. Um, notably, um, there was a suggestion to use um, blue uh, uh, clay, blue hardened clay, um, with instructions on how to make blue hardened clay, so uh, bonus points for that. Um, and I'm going to do it back in the Mesa, um, and I have an idea. I was... a uh, before I logged on while I was having dinner, I was having a look at um, some architecture ideas uh, for what we could do. Okay, and we were out here. Oh, that's right. This was we were doing we were doing recon. Okay, so we've got a torch here and here, so I can spot these from afar. And let's have a look around. Um, I was I was looking up before I before I came across. Um, oh. I know this seems ridiculous to pick up, but we can make flower pots with this. Um, anyway, uh, uh, bu -bu -bu -bum. I keep losing my train of thought today. I'm sorry. Um, anyway, uh, I was looking up some architecture. That's where I was going with this. I was looking up some architecture prior to logging on to um, to see kind of what I wanted to do. And um, there's actually a restaurant at the um, the Sedona Airport that I think is um, is kind of inspiring. Um, I have it open in the background, so I can um, so I can use it as a uh, as a template for some ideas here. Um, but I don't want to follow it exactly, so I'm not going to reference it a whole lot. Um, essentially, what I liked about it was that it used something that looked very similar to a lean-to uh, as its roof, and I like the idea of maintaining a little of that um, that feel of of uh, you know this being in a in a desert area. You know, and you know, with the structures being a little more natural instead of um, instead of always being reliant on um, you know very modern architecture. So I guess I like this area because it, it really feels very survivally to me instead of instead of me trying to build it into something it's not. Um, so I was looking up something to try to use the blue. Um, cold colors are very much more modern, so a lot of what I was coming up with um, had a lot more modern feel. But I think that I like. The uh, what I'm going to do with this one with the blue, and um, it's probably going to be uh, integrated with some brown, and I hope that you guys enjoy it. Um, unfortunately, it'll probably be a couple episodes before we get back there, um, so you'll have to stick with me. I'm going to try to do a little of it tonight. Um, I won't be able to do a lot of episodes tonight because I do have kind of a thing at work going on right now, and um, this is me taking a break from work before I get back into it to try to relax a little bit. Um, work has been brutal. So, it is what it is, though. That's why I've got Minecraft, right? Right. It's my little quiet world here on Minecraft. Um, I don't know if I've mentioned it before. I do social media. Uh, that's my for my job. Um, I jokingly tell people that it, essentially what that means is I get to play on Facebook um, for work every day. And um, while that's not technically inaccurate, um, play is probably the wrong word for it because I certainly... Um, I, I get to deal with a lot of people who are not extraordinarily happy uh, with whatever services have been rendered to them. So, um, it's, a, it's a fine job, though. I actually really like it. Um, I, I, I know that it seems funny for somebody who's, um, you know, who does these kinds of videos and things like that to say that they don't particularly like being on the phones, but <laughs> I don't particularly like being on the phones. Um, I, I have lost the ability to hide what I'm thinking in my voice. Um, I used to have that ability. I used to be really good at that. Ooh, found a cave. Hello, cave. Um, but I have since lost that ability fairly outright, and so now um, whatever... Ooh. Ooh. Um, whatever I'm thinking, really just, it's it just comes out of my mouth at this point, and 
Uh, so at least on social media, I have an opportunity to... Um, oh, I don't like that sound. Um, at least on social media, I have the opportunity to, uh, you know, to temper what I'm saying fairly nicely. So, um, so if it sounds like I'm relaxed or, or you know, chill doing these videos, uh, rest assured I actually am. Because um, <laughs> I have a very hard time of disguising it anymore. Um, yay. I was kind of hoping we might get some of this so we could pick up some more wool. Because um, I like paintings. This, this ties back into the whole Daisy thing where um, everybody's playing it to survive and I'm playing it to get find a book, because that's me. Um, anyway, not just any book, mind you. Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Anyway, um, so yeah, I, it's, it's actually, um, it, it's kind of funny to hear my voice on, on this. I think this, I think my headset, oops, excuse me. Uh, that would be my alarm. Uh... Uh, you know how much, how much I love these guys. So I have a medication I have to take every day at the same time. And I've set my alarm to alert me of that fact. Um, so anyway, I was saying that I, I think my headphones here at home pick up my voice better than, um, than the phones ever did. Um, whenever I hear myself on the phones, I always feel like I sound like, I don't know, different, weird. Um, although it's also been pointed out to me that I have a very particular voice when I'm speaking, and I know people are listening, so there's that as well. Although I don't know that it necessarily comes out, hey, piggies! I don't know that it necessarily comes out, ooh, did we bring carrots? I might have. I might have. Um, what's that? I'm going to take a little wander over here, because that's different. I'm not sure what that is. In case you all are wondering what I'm chickens, what I'm looking at, um, there's something orange on the horizon there, which I, probably is just lava. Um, but with all the new changes, I thought I would have a pokey, pokey look -see. Looks like it is just lava. Okay. Chickens, hi chickens. You guys, have you guys laid any eggs for me? You would be the easiest animals to cart back if you would just lay eggs. Pretty please with sugar on top. Yeah, look, that's on fire over there. It's definitely lava. Yeah. Um, oh, oh, the sun is setting. The sun is setting. Let us... Oh. Nerf. Let's see if we can make our way back to our little safe haven. Because um, I don't like being too far from... You all know how I get lost, so I don't like being too far from, from uh, our, our point of origin. I'm also probably going to grab some of these flowers before we head back, because um, I'm silly like that and I want to put flowers around. So, there is that. Oh, that was almost really stupid. Um, oh, <laughs> at least I'm in the water. He won't chase me into the water. Ugh. I don't know why I just like those guys so much. I mean, the boyfriend kind of teases me about it because they're really not that bad. Because you don't, I mean, you won't. They won't spawn unless you, you know, or they won't attack you unless you look at them. But I, I think it's just something about the noise is just like wigs me out. I'm just creepy. And don't get me wrong. I love, I love, um, I love horror movies. I love, you know, like. I'm totally not like a wussy girl, but that being said, I just don't like the noises they make. Um, I have decided, oops, that was a little stupid, um, that we need to have another one because I keep collecting things and I don't want them to get lost. So. Um, I don't want to do something stupid and end up like, you know, oh, hey, that's cool. Look at that. All right. I don't want to do something stupid and end up like having to walk all the way back here from the other, um, from the other way and have it be a big mess. Can I bring any? Oh, derp. I did. Aha. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And I did bring some carrots. Man, sometimes I outsmart myself. Only sometimes, though. It's not often. Okay, 
so here's what we're gonna do. Oh, and it's a new moon also. Mm. This is um This is kind of the epitome of bad news right here. Just uh just tossing that out there for everybody. Um not news we like to receive with being a new moon outside. That means extra monsters might spawn. So we're just gonna do a little bit of patchwork here. And I think I might put in like a step. Did I bring these steps? I did not. Let's check it. Just enough. Yay! <laughs> Here we go. Might, uh, for style. Just for style. I loved when they did this, by the way, when, when suddenly, like, things worked like that. It was... made me very happy. Kiddo, where are you? Probably over my head. You guys can't see him, he's in the water over there. And he's having kind of a difficult time making it over here, so I'm just gonna leave him alone for a moment. Oh, there he comes. There's a skelly behind him. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can swim. What is he holding? Is he holding something? No. La 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 Here we come. There's a little skelly, buddy. I feel like my stairs have confused the skeleton. I somehow feel like they're having a hard time with the staircase. Which is somewhat amusing. I brought a bow with me. I mean, arrows are kind of hard to come by right now. Oh, 
I know why I'm hoping those chickens will lay some eggs. We need chickens and we need cows. <laughs> I can survive without pigs. Though we do have the means to breed them. Ow. Come on, honey, you're aggroed now. You might as well come up and say hi. Did I look at one? Oh, for a second there, I thought I heard the... the ender sound creeping up on me. You can do better than that. Come on. We are verified and are safe, um, at least for a couple of steps, Oops. because of this. So even if he comes inside, he won't be able to hit us. Although, looking at it, I think we are going to verify and are safe on this side as well. Like that. And that way we can stand in the doorway, and Mr. Enderbutt will not be able to, uh, to attack us from either side, because he's three feet blocks tall. Check it out. Look at that sunrise. Hmm. I apologize if you can hear me eating. Um, I made myself some chocolate covered blackberries for dessert. And uh, I was having those before they go bad because chocolate covered blackberries is delicious. If you've never had chocolate covered blackberries, I recommend them. My sister introduced me to them. I'm not disappointed at them. Made them. Well, we have a uh, we have survived another day. Um, this is not my favorite house we've created, but it's not a bad house. Um, what I do want to do is get into a little bit of gardening over here. <laughs> Dry, rainy. Right. Anyway, um, what I do want to do is get into a little bit of gardening over here. Um, I want to go ahead and, and uh, farm up some um, wheat and some um, carrots on this side. Um, that way, in case you know it becomes entirely too difficult, which, given the amount of distance we're going to have to cover to get the uh, to get the animals to the other side, at least we can breed them over here and then come back to them um, at our leisure. So, which I think is going to be uh, how this is going to play out. Um, so that being said, uh, join us again next time, uh, where hopefully we will continue to do pretty well over here in the Not Mesa. Um, <laughs> uh, have a great day, YouTube, and uh, I hope to see you soon. Um, thanks for checking in as always, and uh, keep having fun.